you know, put the easy kit disc in your CD drive, and then when the auto drive, um, the auto run software thing comes up, do not install the driver. That's the first part. Second part, you want to install the, um, the, the video studio, and you want to be, you, you, uh, sorry, you're going to want to reboot after that. Um, and then, yeah, you basically won't need the CD anymore once you have this already on your computer. And then the step, th step three, there's about six steps here. It says do not install the EasyCAD um, USB drive yet, so don't, don't put it into your computer. Don't put the actual device in your computer. And then the fourth step is install the software um, that, you have, that you have saved, which I have, there's actually a YouTube link that um, a guy put up to to the software. I put it in my, and I put it in my computer. Um, so you're gonna, it's called USB ABCPT setup for Windows 7. So basically, you know, you can search that and find this guy. Um, one of his, there's about three YouTube videos, just pick any one. Um, you're gonna want to install that. It's the same software that comes with the EV kit on the CD. So, um, you just, you know, it's for Windows 7. It's made for Windows 7. It's a great thing. And it works for, it works. The quality. My testing is good. Alright, um, step number five is plug the easy cap device, the actual USB stick, into your USB port, and then you're going to want to, uh, um, sorry, yeah, you're going to want to reboot your system. But sorry, after, after step number four, after you install the, um, software that you download, you're going to want to reboot, and step number five, after you put it in, you're going you're to want to reboot so it can, um, set itself up. That's a pain in the butt, I know, but, uh, you don't want to have to do it. Alright, and then step number six, um, let's see, after, after you reboot, you, it says to use the, the U-Lead software, but I tested that out, I was working on it for about 20 minutes, it would not, it, would, it let me see my screen, but it would not let me hit capture video, so I used the, um, AM cap, was able to easily download that online, just look that up, um, and you're able to just go in there, and basically hit, make sure you hit your device, it's going to say hit, it's going to say devices, Make sure it's probably gonna say like USB 2.0 or something. So make sure you hit it, and then you're gonna want to pick out which audio if you want to not have the audio and the audio of my video that I just did didn't work. So I did, I just did no audio because it was a lot of noise and it's pretty late to hear. Um. So yeah, and then you're gonna want to just hit start capture. And you can capture. I only did it for about 30 seconds, and then you're going to you get you're gonna do that, and then you can hit. Um, stop capturing and I had to save it on my desktop so you can just easily find it.